mentioned that the balance was six hundred and forty three thousand twenty two pounds, right? Yeah. Okay, so the one initially another from the twenty first of March up until the twenty second of June, there was initially another bill that was uh that was updated on the system or on the account. Yeah, right? they've updated it because they have assumed I'm still with them because they won't acknowledge that I am not in contract yeah. and never have been in contract with them. But I said I'm yeah. agreeing to pay the £643 for now and I'm happy to phone up once a month and offer £30. But I'm not willing to pay the bill after... Uh, March because I spoke to the general manager and I and I sent three letters by recorded delivery so they know that I'm not in contract and that I'm a living woman and not, I was never in contract with them but if you want me to make a payment of £30 towards the bill of £643.22 I'm happy to do that today yes no I understand what you're saying also but I think it's the reason why I was saying that, the reason why I was mentioning that they've updated the bill on the system, the balance on the account now is not the same as the one that you mentioned. No, because they've decided to make up a new balance and make up yeah. a new number and they've decided to charge me for that and, and I'm not agreeing to that. That's 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 wrong. <laughs> that's they they can't they can't just make up a number um when I've already written three times to the general manager i don't have the british gas um meters in my property and i have nothing more to do with british gas but are you aware of the, the, of the outstanding balance now it's over a thousand pounds but I, it's a it's a it's an estimate and uh, i'm not